Uh huh. Isn't it? Okay. Hey. Talking about bike life. Oh, Look. Okay, what, um, ah. what you want to talk about? What you want to talk about? Bike life. Okay. Um. What you want to know? Oh wait. You already know everything. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Um. <laughs> oh oh. Uh. Yeah. I, I, MLK. Tell them. You tell them. You tell them. <laughs> What's going on, YouTube? Casino Smooth here. Is Little Uzi Vert gay? I don't know. You tell me. Have you seen his most recent? moves lately you know i'm not talking about the regular shoulder roll i'm talking about some extra stuff some extra stuff where he's going like this to his face and blowing his hair back is he gay well guess what i think it's all for show i think it's a publicity stunt and i think it's what it's what's helping him um, you know boost those album sales that's what i think in those digital streams you know what i'm saying uh, i think you need controversy if you want to make it in the music industry you want to have a story behind you, and that story has to co consist of controversy. People need to constantly be asking questions about your music career and who you are. Who is that guy? Why is he doing that? Oh, let's argue in the comment section, right? You need something behind you that makes tons of controversy so that way you can stay relevant, all right? Let's take 6969, for example. He just started getting more popular. He started coming up simply because of his hair color and is he gay? Who doesn't know? I don't know, you know, but it's only a matter of time before the whole gay controversy thing stands out. So you guys need to get something new. But that was just a quick tip for today. You guys need controversy in your music careers to stay relevant these days. And if you don't have it, then you don't have it. OK, get it together, guys. Let's go.